Hi, how is everybody today on this Sunday evening? Um, I'm just sitting here today, just checking that I'm live. Hope everybody's having a great Sunday and had a fantastic weekend. It was a beautiful sunny day here in Buffalo, so it's always nice to see the sun shining. Great, I'm live, so that's what I just wanted to check. So I was just sitting here. I just thought I'd come live for a couple minutes. I just have something short and quick that I wanted to say. I was just go going through Facebook and getting some things organized for the week. And anyways, as I was going through Facebook, I, a lot of there's been a lot of posts, um, especially today or over the weekend about, you know, kindness and being kind and showing kindness. So I just thought it would be fun to come and share a little bit, a little story with you guys. So I don't know if a lot of you guys know, but I've been a flight attendant for over 30 years. Sadly, I'm, I can't fly right now because of an injury, but I'm not going to go into that on this live stream. But I've had many, many like interesting experiences over the years, as you can probably imagine, right? So anyways, if you guys are joining on live, please say hi. I'd love to see you. If you're catching me on the replay, say hi. Let me know where you're tuning in from. I always like to come back and, you know, say hi to anybody who watches my um, live streams or videos. So, as I was saying, I've had so many interesting things happen while flying and a lot of things with famous people, right? I mean, we fly famous people all the time, especially if I would be doing a lot of West Coast flights. So I want to share this story and I'll probably have to come back and edit the title of this video. But um, this is a really cool story and why I wanted to share it was, like I said, I've said I've been seeing so many posts talking about being kind and showing kindness and you know what others see people do like people tend to mimic others right especially people that are maybe um influential or um somebody that people look up to right so i had the honor and pleasure let me tell you of having billy joel on a flight one time now everybody has to know who billy joel is right so that's why i picked um, him to use for this story because obviously I've had many instances but with Billy Joel he was actually had a private plane that broke down so him and his whole band and entourage and um, whoever was um, flying on this trip he was doing a tour obviously and um, so he had a, a bunch of people with him in his group right so they all came over onto our flight to go where they were going and it was really interesting because um, you, you never really know, right, with celebrities, how they're going to be. So I have to say, I was so glad because I love Billy Joel. I'm a huge Billy Joel fan, right? So I always love when like people that I like or, you know, musicians or stuff like that are nice. And Billy Joel was so polite, like so polite. It was he was so like kind, right, to everybody. And it didn't matter, like every time you went up to him, when you, you know, you were serving or taking care of things, he always said, please and thank you. You could tell he had a great rapport with his band, just the way he was talking to them and stuff like that. And then that you have that trickle down, right? So everybody that was in his group that day on our flight was the same way. Everybody was so kind and nice and use their manners and like please and thank you and it was so nice to see that right because here is somebody who's huge right i mean my gosh billy joel is one of the biggest performers right around and he didn't have that attitude at all you know um that some people tend to get when they get famous <clears throat> but so i just wanted to kind of share that story because you know, we try to be kind. Most people do try to be kind in everyday life, right? And do little things here and there. But you don't realize just the simple things like um, saying please or thank you or looking at somebody when they're talking to you, right? And not looking over here or looking over there like you're not really, it doesn't matter what they have to say. Is That's kindness in itself. And it goes a long way for people. And just by, you know, somebody who is in a place like that to show kindness, 
everybody around sees those things people that look up to you know to these types of people so no matter what kind of position you're in you know people are looking up to you somewhere right so it's always good to be that kind of role model i guess is what i'm looking for and um people will hopefully mimic the way you treat other people so i just wanted to share that little story today and um I hit, oh, I see a couple of people joined. Sorry, I was missing. I got to look at my phone for it. So, hi, Chrissy. Thanks for joining. And um, hey, Ronnie. So it was um, just a short little story I wanted to um, share instead of just doing a post about being kind. I just thought I'd share this little personal story that I had. And just remember that people are always watching you, right? And people are always looking up to you. And um, it's always good to be that kind of leader and role model that you want other people to mimic in their life. So I hope everybody has had a fantastic weekend and enjoyed their Sunday like I did here with my family. Um, we were celebrating celebrating my mom's birthday today, so that was nice and we all got together. And I will let you guys go and have a great rest of your evening and I'll be talking to you soon.